Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nog. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Definitivim by RoboSK. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's jump into the description. Uh, map created in B 2.4.34.1, tested by MIT. Uh, map is update. The bug is repaired in the room with the light bridge. Have fun. Alrighty then. Let's see what we've got here then, shall we? Paint fizzler. Okay. Interesting. So where is square? Square turns off the funnel. put it there. That's perhaps where I need to go with this. Okay, hence the button. Gotcha. Okay. Save. Okay, so that should should that loop round? Okay, so that can't go through there, but it can go through here. That drops a sphere, I think. Okay, so that allows me access over to here. So I think I'm going to need to send gel onto this side as well, aren't I? I think. So let's send gel onto the side. Like I had originally planned, I guess. Okay. Pop that back up there. And then... Can we now go... Over here, yes, we can. Okay, so we need something there to ensure it opens that up. Let's grab a save. Or we proceed down to here. Door shuts behind us. We have a lot of connections here, so we need two things here to activate that. Cheers, this and this. But how long does that? Okay. So we do this. This is that cube. So I think this is going to bootstrap the laser if we can hit this, right? We've got to get hit it through here because the lasers won't penetrate the the white. Uh, fields. I can't remember what they're called, but they basically block everything. Oh, I'm glad I hadn't swapped the cube. Might need to swap the cubes thinking about it, though. Keep that in mind. But yes, that now gives us a bootstrap laser now. Did we need to swap the cubes? I think so. 
so. This one is going to go in this position here. And then take this cube and pop it over here to create the bootstrap. Ways, but I want to do it just like that, just to be sure. So I think we're going to do this. And then this one can turn around to there. And then we can also get the sphere. Alright, save there. And I think we've done that part. Okay. That is an escape route. So, next up we're going to go back round, I guess. And put it on the other side. What's down here, I wonder? Ah, uh, it's another escape path. Okay. Interesting. Actually, we could potentially drop the cube down here eventually. I think that's probably what we're going to want to do. Because it's before the fizzler, isn't it? Yes. Okay. So again, we'll keep that move in mind, but we'll, for now, head on over to the next section. Okay, so more of the same. can have that this time. So that's, we need to reverse that to do that. And it's also connected to something through there. Which does the reversing. Okay. So going to do here is moving along the lines of this which will allow us to go over to here Okay, so I've got to keep the light bridge there, basically, is what that's telling me, isn't it? Yes. So I've got to keep this suspended over the light bridge, because as a player, I am... Um... Okay... So I have the ability here to do some uh, momentum. So I think what I'm going to want to do is jump down here. Let's get back on the light bridge a moment. Jump down here. Go through a portal. Surface, please. Okay. 
Okay, so now I have that. So what this will now enable me to do is... Actually, I'll just leave that there for now. So put that there. Jump back through here. From right here. Back onto the light bridge. Like so. Then we can make sure this is a long way ahead of that. Jump back through to here. If everything goes right. Please go away. Okay, and now this will let me have the other sphere. Just like that. Ooh, wait a second though. There we go. Whew, panic over. I panicked. Okay. So then we just need the cube, right? So. If I am right about this. I need to drop the cube down to there. I could just bounce over here with the cube. I don't need to take the cube anywhere, though. I could have dropped the cube down that fizzler, that field there, but I could also do this. Which is just as easy. Alright. Save. Continue. Okay, so the exit is through there. Well, see, I can't do that. So now, oh dear God, hold on. Okay. I need to loop Joel first. That's what I need to do. Also, I didn't notice that flip arm before. That was a bit uh, silly of me. Oh, missed it. Alright, let's try that again. Actually, I can just do that from there. It's fine. Yep. And I bounce up onto the walk walkway. I'm still not done, of course. That would be foolish. So I want the cube back here. Actually, that shouldn't be too much of an issue. Swap that one to there. And that should be that. Alright, well, that was... There was a little bit of thought in that second room, I think. Other than that, it was pretty pretty linear, um, I have to say. Um, but, well, I, I don't think anything is... 
I don't think there's anything too breaking in there or, or, or many ways to break the puzzle. Um, but yeah, I just do think it was a little bit um, straightforward, maybe in comparison to some of your other maps. But um, nonetheless, still a very good map, Robo. Thank you very much for suggesting. Guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any match you'd like to play, please leave in the comments or head up to my Google form. I'll link that in the description. But until next time, I've been Ock, you've been awesome. See ya.